While most professional athletes will retire and maybe take the route of broadcasting or continuous endorsement deals, rarely do we see them go into children's books and animation, but not our guest. It is my pleasure to welcome in former pro football defensive end Trevor Price. Trevor, how you doing? I'm good, how are you? I'm doing well, thank you so much for joining us. Now, I want to get right into it. You had an incredible 14-year career, which included two championships, four Pro Bowl appearances. Is there a specific moment in your time in the league that really stands out to you? Uh, the day I was drafted, um, and that starts, up, that starts up what, you know, what your career will be, and, you know, you're in your parents' house, and um, there's Polaroid pictures of me and, and my girlfriend, now wife, um, and my parents and my little sister. And, uh, you know, um, that starts a journey because you, your life changes that day for better or worse. You, you don't really know. Um, but the day I was drafted is, you know, I was, supposed to, I was supposed to be drafted by them. I was supposed to be drafted by Philadelphia. And they, did, they skipped over me. So I got really angry. And I became the best defense lineman in Denver history. So that, that day sticks out very good really in my mind yeah you really showed them now once you retired you went into your creative side wrote a children's book started a full service production company what sparked your desire to go down that path um i want to score a picture i want to be a, 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 a i want to be a film composer right i want to um write music for film but i can't write music i can make music but you can't i can't read or write music so if you want to score a film, you have to make your own film. It turns out I was good at making the films. I was good at um, writing the scripts and writing the stories and whatnot. So I made that the career rather than the music um, aspect of it because there's only one Hans Zimmer, right? And I was not going to be that. <laughs> so I decided, yeah, I'll be J.J. Abrams. Hey, it really worked out for you. So what projects do you currently have in the works that maybe you can share with us? We're working on the third season of Killer Party right now. Um, I can't tell you where we're putting it because um, it hasn't been announced yet. But we're also working on the 3D reboot um, of the show as well, live action. We're doing both of those here in the studio in Baltimore um, with the full crew and whatnot. So it's the first time that we're doing it outside of Canada, but um, I, think, I think we're going to do something really special with it. Wow, that sounds so exciting. I'll definitely be on the lookout for all of that. Thank you so much for your time, Trevor. No worries, no worries.